Hello everyone, this is Ibrahim Absalam. In this video, I will show you how to build a logo network project. Our case study is write a BBC program and draw the power and BBC connection of a motor control center that can use to fulfill the following function direct online uh, starting of three phase induction motor, such as cursor up start, cursor down, cursor down stop, and Q1 is the motor. Uh, the software you would to program logo is called logo soft comfort okay, Once it open we select network project add a new device The one I have logo 8.fs4 so, Okay press on the setting button Go to online setting. Before press refresh, uh, we, your logo must be powered on, and the Acer network connected to the uh, to your uh, computer or your laptop. Press refresh. Now the logo soft comb for trying to find the logo. Unfortunately, it didn't found. If you look to Acer network, it was uh, taken to the wireless LAN. Change it to your PC, uh, PCI cable or PCI socket uh, Ether network, and then. Press refresh again. Okay, uh, the logo is found here. Double click and this is the connection. Now the connection is fine and is connected to the logo. The, so the network is okay. Press OK. Now from, uh, we need to have our cursor up. And cursor down here to this cursor down, up cursor down, cursor key from cursor key, and output. We can drag and drop output, and we will need an OR gate and AND gate. One OR gate and one AND key. So if the user press on start button, so Now, if the user press on start, the motor will start, and we need to make our latch. Okay, this is a stop signal, so I need to make it not. I double click here, I convert it from wire mode to pointer or selector. I double click here to make it not and connect. That's our circuit. Now we, we need to simulate our program, so I press the simulation button. Cursor on will start the motor, or motor is running. Cursor down, the motor stop. Next, we need to download the program to our logo. We can see here this scroll button. This one, put logo in uh, start mode, stop uh, logo. Uh, from PC to logo, from logo to PC, so we need to transfer this program from PC to logo. So press this one. This is the connection. Okay, now connect uh, to PA or the the software now before programming the mode the logo must go to stop mode then it will be programmed and then we'll go to run mode again so okay now it's program go to run mode again it's now run after downloading the program to logo we let's see how the logo look like uh, it consists of a screen and four cursor button and one escape and one okay button by default the, the screen will show the date and time uh, you we have nine different screen each screen give individual data we can go browse the screens using the cursor right and the cursor left so by cr pressing cursor right we go to the first screen which indicates the input status so if any input is high or active it will indicate or we can recognize it from this screen second 
screen till the status of the output data or the digital output third screen is regarding for the analog inputs the fourth screen for the rest of analog signals input signals fifth is the analog output signals seventh the rest of analog signals Seventh is the memory uh, status, to indicate which memory is uh, iterative one and the memory status value. Eight. Now the cursor uh, control it is the ninth screen to press. In uh, for example, if I want to press up cursor to turn on the motor, I had to press escape plus the up cursor as I will show you. Now I press escape and up sorry skip and up now we go back to see how it look the output is activated you can see here it indicates that the output one is high now okay output I'll, I'll go back to screen nine and I press skip and down and go back now the outputs appear okay to monitor the logo program in a state of press simulation we can press here online testing just press the software will start to communicate with our with logo okay you can see here uh, if i can't activate this button since i'm in online test it must be physically pressed so i will press i go to screen 9 okay when i press high it's clear that the uh, current signal comes from cursor 1 and cursor 1 activated and the output is high the latch effect is now is clear so the signal flow from the output to the OR and keep turning on if i press cursor down the motor will stop okay let's see the power and control circuit connect or uh, power and pvc connections the power is similar like relay logic uh, we have three phase supply circuit breaker contactor overload and our motor the PLC connection only in Q1 we use the cursors as a digital input so we don't have any digital inputs and the Q1 is the output which energizes the coil for contactor 1 which energize the motor will power okay we need to add the overload signal so to protect our motor from overload so we just add the overload signal the overload uh, contact will call power to connect it to I1 we can add it in our program out from online monitoring we now add one more input it's i1 double click communicate simulation we make it looks like a push button convert it to button to make it not and to have a look and here's. okay we can simulate this program so if I press start, the motor is running. I press stop, the motor stop. I press start, the motor is now running. And overloads happen. So once it's received, the motor will immediately stop. Thank you for listening and goodbye.